It is my joy and privilege to be addressing this European prayer breakfast. I speak as a bishop responsible for 300 Anglican congregations across Europe, as a resident of Brussels for 15 years, as an Englishman proud to be a citizen of Belgium and the European Union. In our Gospel reading, Jesus teaches about wisdom. Wisdom, he says, consists in hearing the words of the Lord and then acting upon them. That is like building your house on a rock. Foolishness, by contrast, is to hear the Lord's words, but not to act. That is like building on sand. We are fortunate to live in a European house whose architects were intent on building on the rock. Statesmen like Schumann, Adenauer and de Gasperi put their faith into practice in Christian democracy. Robert Schumann was outspoken that post-war reconstruction was only possible in a Europe deeply rooted in Christian values. And so Christian values of reconciliation, peace building and solidarity were built into the foundations of the EU. In 2020, we are aware of the fragility of our European house, with tensions between member states and the damaging effects of Brexit. Covid-19 represents a massive challenge to our economies and healthcare systems. Black Lives Matter presents us with uncomfortable truths about our failures in racial justice. There are cracks appearing in our European house. The house needs to be repaired and strengthened. If we're to build on rock, not sand, how are Christian leaders and politicians to hear the words of Christ and act upon them today? We might start with Jesus' foundational summary of the law, to love the Lord our God and to love our neighbour as ourselves. In a Europe which is now pluralist, may the God who inspired so much of our architecture, so much of our culture, so many of our values, always be honoured and worshipped. Let's not be embarrassed to name the name of Jesus. Let us love the Lord our God. And may love of neighbour be a principle which even those who don't share our beliefs acknowledge as foundational to our shared social life. This is a love which welcomes the alien and the stranger, which pursues justice for the poor, which builds up solidarity and which seeks the common good. Love of neighbour works itself out in justice and fairness and kindness and care at every level of our social and political life. God give us grace to build and rebuild our European house on firm foundations. So when the rains fall and the floods come and the winds blow, may our European house stand firm because it has indeed been built upon the rock.